Researchers at UC San Diego have developed a new way to treat patients suffering from phantom pain. They're using a stimulator that stops pain signals from being sent to the brain. As Sarah Acosta explains, patients can control the stimulator with Bluetooth. Raul Silva had his leg amputated in San Diego after a motorcycle accident in Mexico. I uh, lost my leg in 2000. Um, since that day, I have uh, the phantom pain. His leg is gone, but he felt cold, numbness, and a terrible pain there. He worked to support his family for a while, but had to stop. Then his doctors told him about a new pain control system called dorsal root ganglion stimulation, or DRG. The dorsal root ganglion is a offshoot of your spinal cord that correlates to a very specific nerve that's coming from your spinal cord to a specific extremity or a portion of your back. Roll did a seven-day trial with a temporary device sending electrical pulses to block pain signals to the brain. The analogy I give is if you have like a 16-lane highway of a bunch of cars that are driving, we're effectively setting a roadblock across that highway. After 17 years of suffering, Raul reported his pain was gone. And it was amazing, because um, for instance, the, the beginning, um, I feel like a really empty person, because there were no pains, no, no phantom pain, no cramps, nothing like that. Raul became UC San Diego's health patient number one for the permanent DRG stimulator. The battery is implanted, and he controls the intensity and location of the stim with this Bluetooth device. He says the system is giving him his life back. In a randomized trial, 74% of patients reported meaningful pain relief, compared to 53% who got standard dorsal column spinal cord stimulation. The DRG stimulator is FDA approved. The system cost around $25,000, but can be as much as $40,000, which can be covered by insurance. Sarah Costa, KSAT 12 News.